Okay, moving on from The Lion King, we have Mulan for Genesis. Hey, calm down, Mushu, would you? Maybe tread a little more lightly. Some people are trying to sleep around here. Wanna be a man. Well, I mean, I don't know. I I've considered it. I don't know if I'm ready to make the decision, though. But thanks for the offer. If you haven't seen the movie, this is a horribly mistranslated reference to the song Be a Man from Mulan. But hey, at least they're trying to give us the option, huh? Alright, the game starts, and of course, they don't use the song that this level is based on. Why would they? Mulan, what the fuck? You know those people, they're your friends! Yeah, in, in the movies, she's friends with these characters, but I guess in the world of pirated games, it's just a free-for-all. Oi, what is this? A Freddy Krueger glory hole? The absolute most I can say for this game is that at least it attempts to be somewhat familiar with the subject matter. The characters look pretty convincingly like they could be from an actual Disney licensed game, so alright. Greatest Wall. Nah. It's completely subjective. <laughs> No planet. Yeah, as you know, Mulan has always been the best sci-fi. <laughs> and he's dead. All right, nice job, guys, except for on those hearts. They're terribly, terribly asymmetrical, and you should be ashamed. Hey there, John. Who are you? I'm the Great Bootleg. That's hokey, and old JonTron was better. Wanna see something real bad? No. Too bad, bitch. Dying, 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 death, death, help, help, barf, 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 no one can stop the pain, please can you stop the pain? Oh, that's gross, man, what the hell? Oh, horrific. And then magically, John got the box of that disc. <laughs> Snow White and the Seven Clever Boys. Okay, every now and then, you see something you just can't believe is real. This is one of those moments. How could anyone have let this happen? Seven clever boys? Are, are these the boys? They don't look so clever. Uh, come to think of it, neither does anyone in this picture. They look like they were the result of a brother and sister who liked each other maybe just a little too much. This is an actual licensed game for the PS2. Shit, I would have preferred Lion King 2 over this nonsense. Oh, this is real, all right. Look at that menu screen. Okay, we got a confused starfish, an artistic crab, a very stupid alligator, and this thing. Oh, also, we got the main cast here in the middle feeling very stranded and very helpless to amend the situation they're in. Snow White and the Seven Clever Boys. Snow White and the Seven Clever Boys! What is that fucking name? Who made this? I'm not gonna get over that. I, I absolutely guarantee you I'm never gonna get over that name. I'm a clever boy. Put me in, huh? Put me on that. Get me in that. But I digress. This game starts off with like a film. Not quite so long ago, and not so far away, Near back the seventh to menu, town to across menu, the seventh river, there was a beautiful forest, kept perfectly in order by seven clever and thoughtful young boys. And here they are. And here they are! Let's get right to it, come on! First, there was Cubby, who was like a small bear. A small bear? In what sense is this child like a small bear? He's not even wearing a bear on a t-shirt or anything. And then there was Big Basil, who was huge. Well, for a boy, he was huge. Ah, it's too late, narrator! You already called the kid fat! It's not going back! And then Sonny, who took care of the plants and the animals. What? And was also a very racist depiction of a black person. This game was approved by Sony with that in it? Nice call, guys. Really good one. Also, maybe, you know, next time don't take too much fashion advice from Uncle Sam and the Harlem Globetrotters. This is my song. I'll sing it now. Oh, sick lyrics, dude. Sick song! Get me out of here. Get me out of here right now. The real game, if you could call it that, is just absolute nothingness. It's literally just mini games of sliding puzzles, jigsaw puzzles, and coloring books. I don't know what convinced someone that this 
is the thing that they should make for the world to see. But you out there who made this, I got one thing to say to you, all right? Follow your dreams, but not this hard. Don't, don't follow them so hard that this happens, but follow your dreams. Well done. Back to menu. Next. Well, I think we covered it all. I think that's everything. Let it go! Let it go! Don't hold it back anymore! Another letter? Huh. I feel unexplained joys and sorrows, but alas, I am synthetic. All right, Shaq, come on, I'm doing something here. Dress up who? Oh, I gotcha. This was a mistake! Well, actually, Dress Up Who is a website, I guess, with dress up games and girl games. We got Poo Kitchen Slacking, it's girl games. We got Clean Up Horse Farm 2, no boys allowed. Also, I gotta check out Clean Up Horse Farm 1 sometime. Sounds, sounds pretty good. Easily, the most fascinating thing about this website is its section on Frozen games, which there are so many of, but nothing. Nothing comes close to the majesty of the crowning jewel of this website. The one, the only, Elsa! Frozen Brain Surgery. Frozen. Brain. Surgery. What? I cannot even fathom this. At this moment, I'm truly dumbfounded. It's elegant. It's wonderful. It's got a low chance of survival. Oh my god, right there? Right in the right in the brain. Okay. Nighty night, Elsa. It's magical. Well, I, Elsa, I think I, I I see the problem. I see where where, where you might where you might be having some problems. Just gonna just gonna remove these off of you, Elsa. Just don't worry. Okay. The rock. We're getting the rock right out of your brain. And like nothing ever happened. This game was barely girly enough for me. I'm gonna need to see a more great girl games, please. You know. This is fucked right up. There she is. Let's measure that baby. How big is that baby? Yeah, that's about that's the size of a baby, everyone. Yeah, that baby's got a heart too. Unlike the creator of this shit. How many of these are there? Is this a thing? Is this just like an unknown genre? <laughs> what the fuck? No! You are the most adorable baby in the world. I wouldn't say that. Oh my god, you're just gonna walk away? You're gonna turn somebody's baby into a zombie and just gonna you know, dawdle away? Your beautiful baby has a fucking hand coming out of his head now, you're just gonna look mildly disappointed she, when she just walks away? Is, is there a procedure for zombification of baby? Just put a little ointment on it? Yeah, get some of that. Just drop that in the petri dish. Get that horn. Yeah, take the hand off. See, that was really bugging me. Oh! He's fixed! What the hell is this? Elsa, don't give me that cheeky look. All right, you got yourself into this mess. I'm the one helping you get out of it. You're not doing me any favors here. Elsa baby birth. Elsa milking cow. Pregnant Elsa foot check. Foot check. Oh my God! <gasps> Absolutely horrific. Elsa, what are you been doing out there? Why this? Why pregnant foot doctor? How do these concepts sync up? At least there's a nice snowman in the background. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, God. Oh, gee. Oh, Lord in heaven. Why? I'm gonna throw up. I'm gonna actually throw up. I'm not even... <coughs> <coughs> oh, my God. I'm actually gonna barf. I'm not fucking around. <laughs> I can firmly say uh, I didn't like Frozen 4, but that was a solid 10 out of 10 for me. Gonna go watch that movie again. Give it, give it, a, give it a two thumbs up. I'm scarred for life. That, that, that's, this is not a joke. This is not a part of the program. This is for real. I'm, I'm. I can still see it. <laughs> Get out of my brain. Beautiful. <laughs> For watching this episode of JonTron was sponsored by the wonderful people at Loot Crate. They are a monthly subscription box service that specializes in pop culture and gamer gear. They guarantee over forty dollars worth in value in each box. You get about four to eight mystery items in there. Summer limited edition, and you get at least one T-shirt with every box.